Hi, I'm Mike Thompson. We love this zip line. Problem is, the branch that used to hold the brake mechanism broke during the last ice storm. So we had to come up with something new. And what I've got, basically, is a giant counterweight over there on that pole. Let me show you how I built this. I cut a piece of chain link fence pipe and then welded a piece of that pipe onto it so that I could use this to hammer against and then sink this pole two feet into the ground. This is setup number one using 3D printed parts, showing how I've got a block and tackle system here with some weights on this 3D printed trolley that goes up when the brake gets hit. Here's version one of the brake with simply a wooden block in front of a piece of pipe with a D-ring zip tied on to give it a test. And then down there at the end of that tree is the emergency stop, which is three springs threaded onto the pipe to give you about 18 final inches, you know, to cushion your last little bit in case something happens. This is 3D print version two. You see I've got some red sliders here around this green collar just to keep things centered. Found this wasn't really necessary. And then this all, these uh, black plastic hooks here for the weights, of course, got replaced with metal. This carriage top here has several pulleys in it so that the 550 paracord can run smoothly. And this, of course, is a 3D printed part using three millimeter bolts with uh, 623 bearings. And here's the metal carriage with some welded half inch pipe to support these weights. Much, much better. And of course these uh, pavers here <laughs> give you an extra 20 pounds for the heavier people. Even the little guy likes it. And it's smooth enough he can have a drink on the way down. The final brake assembly is 3D printed with bearings inside here. It's a two piece print so you can get it on the line. And then it's cushioned in the front with a wooden block that gets replaced as necessary. But hopefully this inspires you to come up with a solution to one of your own problems. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. I'm Mike Thompson, and thanks for watching. We really appreciate it. Go!